Hello, my name's Andy Johnson. I'm at uh, beautiful Bullion RV in Duluth, Minnesota. Today I'd like to take a little bit of time and show you our new 2012 Cougar 323 MKS. What I'd like to point out to you first is this front cap. Very aerodynamic for when you're on the road. It's nice that it's uh, colored because this is a common spot for it to get bugs and stuff on and it's going to be easy to keep clean and it's also, since it has a color, it's going to not show uh, dirt as much. I also want to show you that you've got a mirror right here to help you hook up. Look up in your rear view mirror and you'll be able to see your hitch run right into your extended pin right there. It's also light, lighted up above. You have front storage right here. And then you've got a 30 pound propane tank on this, a 30 pound propane tank on the other side. I want to take a little minute and show you the big storage underneath. Nice to see that aluminum construction. Nice to see how that Cougar's made. Also want to show you that there, there is lighting in here. You've got a 50 amp cord right there that goes on the back. And then right here I want to point out you can put your TV in here because you got your cable in your 110. You got your steps right here. I always point out you got a light right there underneath your steps. You got the big handle. So when you're coming back from the campfire, you got that light and the big handle. Uh, nice power awning right over the top with speakers on each side there. Okay. Then we got the big slide right here. We'll get to that on the inside in a minute. You got uh, your back jacks here, and then you got power jacks up front. This bumper, spare tire, whole unit pulls right out to about here, and then you can put bicycles on there or other storage. Uh, nice ladder right here. That's where your 50 amp cord plugs into right there as we keep going. Then you've got your big kitchen slide. Refrigerator's right inside here. Okay, right past our water heater right here. We've got uh, kind of our work area here. You've got hot and cold water right there. You've got a light right there. Battery disconnect right here. Nice thing about that, it protects your battery. And then all you got, got your hookups. Next thing I want to point out is right here. Instead of these poles being out in the dirt grime, getting all, all uh, corroded up, they're inside where it's heated. That's where your poles should be, especially in uh, Minnesota. Then you got 30 pound propane tank on this side. Bedroom slide right here. Now we're back to this front cap. So let's get to the important part and get inside. The unloaded vehicle weight of this camper is 9,640 pounds. What we'll do is let's just start with the dining room table right here. One thing I like about these chairs, they, they open up so you can put magazines under there. You got an extension on your dining room table right there, real nice feature. Nice residential couch right here. This couch goes out like a hide bed then there's an air mattress that blows up, lays right on top of it, and then you can put all your bedding and your air mattress right under here. Okay, as we come to the back, one of my favorite features, reclining chair. And then that's going to lead us to my favorite feature in the whole camper, is the fireplace right here. You can have your Labrador Retriever right here in your recliner, you got your fireplace right here. Nice thing about that fireplace is if you have free power, you now have free heat and you don't have to use your propane. Right up above, you got the big TV and this is on an arm, so if you want to watch it from the dining room table or if you want to watch it from here, it's all set up. Uh, I missed the big window in the back, I'm sure you saw it, but that's really one of the nice features about this floor plan. Okay, lots of times when you have an island, it's been real common to have a divider right here. It's really nice when they open this up, you can get through. You still have all the benefits of an island, but it's not kind of closing things off. Then when we have the island, we've got full extension drawers, metal door glides, and lots of storage as you can see. Solid surface countertops, just endless storage. Then right here, you got the microwave right here. You got your fan and light right above your stove top. You got your oven right here. More storage again. And then you've got your fridge right here. Freezer and fridge. And as you come over here, you got the sink right here. You've got covers for your sink. Nice one piece. And then you've got lots of storage right up above. Tons of storage in this camper. Next what I'd like to do is show you the bathroom. We'll come up these stairs, and one thing I missed right here is there's a nice spot for your jacket to get hung right as you come in the door. Okay, next thing right here is there's, this goes right on your keychain, and what you can do with this, when you get to the campground, hop out of your truck, hit a button, your slides go out. Nice thing about that is you can stand outside, watch the tree if you're close, 
and uh, put those slides out. You can put your awning on with that, and you can also turn lights on with that. Next thing I want to show you is this bathroom. Nice things about this bathroom, you've got a nice sink with plenty of storage above and below it. You've got the medicine cabinet there that you just saw. Then you've got a nice tall shower, plenty of width, plenty of height. You've also got a spot to hang your bathrobe there. And then right below you've got the porcelain toilet. That porcelain, nice thing about porcelain is it doesn't stain and it feels a lot more solid. Okay, now as we come up into the bedroom, you've got nice hanging storage all the way across, storage above as well. You've got a nice comfortable mattress here. Then you've got a window that opens on both sides of the bed and you have lights up above as well. Uh, next thing you have is you've got a big exit window right there. So you've got three windows in, in this and it gives you a, kind of a roomy, spacey feel. You've got storage right here and then plenty of storage behind me. And it's nice in these big doors when it pulls all the way out so you can take full advantage of it. Well, that is our 2012 Cougar 323 MKS. My name is Andy Johnson. I'm at Bullion RV in Duluth, Minnesota. If you have any questions about this fifth wheel or any of our other inventory, please call me at 218-391-ANDY. Thanks for watching and have a great day.